How did the pimp costume add to the context? How did that was in the uh, that I mean I did not know that there was a discrepancy between the title sequence. I didn't think it was significant. It never dawned on me that it would ma that it not that it would matter. You don't so, think that was misleading? Why would it be misleading? Hello, the Brad blog. Eric Bullard, you're disgusting. The second thing nobody I'll cares. He is an independent film producer. You're a you've, propagandist for the you've left. Been you want to destroy me? Why does okay. matter? It means nothing! He's a pimp! I'll you know, I've been at loggerheads over this. I don't think it was really fair to insert uh, sections of the video with James O'Keefe dressed out as a pimp if he was actually representing himself as a congressman trying to help Ask these women. Question. Why not just release the full unedited videos? I would re release them. I said that I would release them to, to Eric Holder as well. I released the full tra uh, the full audio transcripts and the full... Here, let's move over here because yes, I can't hear myself. Sorry, man. We're about to go on to now. Okay, well, call me. Call me when, when that happens. I didn't want to do this before you got to go talk to everyone. When... When Hannah and James came to me with their videos, well, it was James technically, it wasn't Hannah. When he came to me, he comes with these edited videos that have a, uh, a title sequence. It has a song. There's a song and a title sequence that is connected to it, not unlike uh, Borat or Ali G right. at the very beginning. That's what I saw. When James and I... Uh, talked about launching these videos, I said, you're going to be held to a different standard than 60 Minutes is going to be held to. You're going to be held to a different standard than Dateline NBC will be held to. But I knew that James and Hannah, in the era of new media, would be held to a higher standard. And so I said, what I would require in order to help them launch your independent film production is on the big government set that we're going to launch, I want the full transcripts and the full audio so people could put into context the edited stuff. How did the pimp costume add to the context? How did, that was in the, uh, that was, I mean, I'm being honest with you. I, I, can't I know, I know. You understand that I've said this before. And I'm not hiding anything. Uh, well, well, okay, it's a simple question, though. How did the it's pimp the costume add to the It's the title sequence, context? like at right. the beginning of Borat. It has music in it. You don't so, think that was misleading? Why would it be misleading? I mean, first of all, the thing is, if you pay attention to the transcripts, there's a complicated scenario. If you paid attention, and if people had shown the the well, you the saw the New York Times. Let me, let me finish. I'm answering your question. Why it matters what a pimp is wearing whether they're dressed you know uh, in you know in a tutu or dressed in a flamboyant outfit when you go in and you try and act like a pimp you're a pimp it never dawned on me who saw the edited videos and who read the transcripts and who heard the audio and that's what I required it never dawned on me that it would ma that it not that it would matter i didn't know but now that but, you know he wasn't dressed in the pimp outfit why continue putting out videos with him dressed it. in the pimp outfit because it's the title sequence it's the title sequence with music. Which has led a lot of the media to believe that he went okay, into these now, offices now, now, please, now, and report. Okay, now, I, I understand your concern about it, and you're, you you have hyperventilated, and you and uh, Eric Bollard and The Brad blog yeah. think that this is the most important revelation in the history of the world. The only faux discrepancy, the only faux discrepancy that you can point out is one that never dawned on anyone that people that people thought was that's not important. quite true I'm sure you've been seeing some of the videos uh, from biggovernment.com these videos were put together by filmmaker James O'Keefe he's dressed exactly in the same outfit that he wore to these uh, acorn offices 
up and down the eastern seaboard. This is the classic sure. case of the left trying to kill the messenger and not wanting to look at what's on, on the tape. He's dressed exactly in the same outfit that he wore to these uh, ACORN offices. Uh, rolling right them out now, and, and your right alliance now, with Fox News, right I think, has worked out right wonderfully now. for you guys. Hello, Eric Bullard. Hello, the Brad blog. Hello, anyone else that I'm thinks... I'm sure they'll see this, all right. Okay, hello to anyone that thinks that I was misleading. I did not know that there was a discrepancy between the title sequence. I didn't think it was significant. My only mistake, and I've admitted it to Brad, I've admitted it uh, now that I now know about it, is that there is a title sequence and it doesn't reflect what he was wearing when he was in there. Nobody wants to look at Acorn. They want to look at this minor discrepancy. Eric Bullard and Brad Bugger, show us the videos, show us the videos, show us the videos. I've said this time and again, and I will say it one more time. I want the world to see the videos. Either Eric Bullard, or John Podesta, or George Soros, uh, or somebody other newsworthy person that would cause the mainstream media to show up and watch this. I will show the entire video. I will take any question under oath. And I will, I will, I will tell the truth. You can care less about the 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 Eric Bullard. You're disgusting. You can care less. This is between. The, no, no, no. Uh, because no, I still have a question. I think it'd be better served in the future if you took off. If you have more videos coming out, if you took off the pimp outfit in the beginning. And the third question I have is, why? You, you folks, hold on. Why? You, because why does it can't? Why does okay. it matter? Nothing. He's a pimp. I'll, I'll, Not a thing. It doesn't matter. It was a title sequence. Do you see? Because you gave everybody. Do you say this because to you Do you say this because to you gave you say everybody? This to Borat, you go when at the beginning of Borat, you're dressed like this, and then in the next scene, you're dressed that, in a different way. If that, it's if a, that wasn't it, in it was, there like that, nobody would have any reason show. to attack you. No, the only no, that was the no, one. No, no, that was no, the one. You've said it yourself. That was the one thing people attack you on. People who are trying to make something out of nothing. It's a it's a diversionary tactic. The second thing. Nobody cares except for you, knuckleheads. The, the, the second thing I wanted to say is that you folks have been meticulous in correcting things. Pimp prostitute you've been walk into you've multiple been meticul acorn offices. Oh. You don't know a single person in your life, I would hope, that would aid and abet a prostitution ring for underage kids. And, and Acorn is ready with the, st the, with the methodology to do so. And you care about whether or not this the, 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 the outfit. I will show the full videos, and, and I'm happy with his title sequence. He is an independent film producer. I can't tell him what to put on these things. Right. Your problem with is James, and I said I will let. I have no problem with him. With full investigations, and you would testify so as well. I think that's transparency. great. Transparency. I'm trying to offer you advice here. I it, don't need you, advice you, from you. Been, you're a propagandist for the you've left. You've been very, very meticulous in yeah. insisting on corrections from media outlets that get things wrong, like he right. was bugging the office where he wasn't. Right. Why not be equally meticulous I have. I have. in I telling have the New York Times he was not dressed as a pimp the way but you reported when he went into the office? But what I saw on the, through the title sequence, that's when I reported that. But now you know it's not true. Okay, right. So why and not I, insist on and I have. them correcting and I said, but, You've asked the New York Times for a correction? I, I don't think it matters, but here's what I'll here's what I'll say. I can understand your, your concern. It doesn't matter at all. To you. It, why does it matter? Because it matters to everyone else. And no, everyone not, else, not everybody and every, else. Everyone, but, but everyone else has used that as a shoehorn to discredit is, no, you. No, 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 but this is, no, no. The, the only people who use it as a shoehorn are people who want to discredit me because I made Why you, give him the shoehorn? Because, because I made you guys if look it idiotic matter, and you want to destroy me. If the transcripts and the audio were there, baby, and you care about what the pimp was wearing.
Well, I care about uh, honest. I care about honest journalism. No, you don't. That's but, I, I honestly that's, do. But, no, you don't. No, I honestly don't. do because you know no, why. You don't care about what's because on the video. you know why. I that's do. I, I do something very similar going. to you folks. That's where your federal money and comes when from. His do you new do media. This with the yes men. Do you tell the he yes men? He calls himself new media. And do you tell, do you tell Michael his Moore that he needs our to, brand do you tell, do you hurts. Michael, yeah, no. Yeah. Do you go after Michael Moore and do you go after the yes men? Do you go after the merry pranksters? Do you go after the unfortunately named Dick Tuck? Do you go after uh, Paul Krasner? Do you go after people? When Hunter Thompson would take hallucinatory yeah. uh, drugs. Okay, and he would envision uh, his subjects, like President Nixon, as if he were a lizard on a wall while he was on the presidential plane.